Hey YouTube, it's been a while since I posted a video. Uh, I've been really busy. We moved to a new apartment, so uh, all the fish tanks, well there's the old ones, but uh, I moved the 30 gallon with all of the fish in it. Uh, well, not in it. I took out 15 gallons of water and put my important fish, like the plecos and the honey garami, princess peach, in the uh, bucket by themselves. And then I put the rest of the fish that weren't so important, like the tetras and the glowfish, in a bucket. And then I put all of the hardscape with some plants, so everything with the moss, all of the wood, the lava rock, the shell, anything with like plants growing on it, I put in a bucket and then I picked out about 40 shrimp from the tank. Uh, I lost about a third of my shrimp in the move, I'm not quite sure why. All of my fish, except one x-ray tetra that I missed when I was catching all my fish, uh, survived. Um, and all of the snails survived, and I only pulled out two of them. The other two moved inside the tank and somehow survived all the shifting, so... Those nerites, they're tough. But... The tank seems to have calmed down. You can see a lot of crypt leaves floating up here. Uh, I'm just kind of letting that go. I'm going to pull them out here in a little bit. Uh, the crypts kind of got a little shocked. Some of the leaves got moved around, and especially over here on the right side. I also sold one on the right side, so that's the other reason it looks a little bare over there. Um, yeah. I don't think any of my plecos are out that you can see right now. But the neons are looking really pretty. Everything lost a lot of color in the move from the stress, and then it all came back in a couple of days. So I moved 15 gallons of this tank's original water. And then I added 10 gallons of local water, and I let the tank run for uh, two days. And then once I figured it had settled down a little bit, I went ahead and topped off the tank then with the rest of the five, six gallons that it needed after the evaporation. Uh, so I tried to shock the system as little as possible, and uh, we'll see... We'll see how that went, but it looks like all my plants are recovering. My crypts have some new leaves, um, so I think I think it'll be all right. But I'm just gonna sit back and put the video on the tank for a while because I don't have too much else to talk about. Alright, thanks for watching.